In this screencast, we're going to determine the units of coefficients that we're going to call A and B that appear in a dimensional homogeneous equation. However, this is a little different than others that you may have seen since we're going to look at a differential equation. So the equation that we're going to look at is d squared x dt squared plus a, our first coefficient, dx dt plus b times x equals 0. And what we need to do is find a and b so that all three terms have the same dimensions. And this is because it's dimensionally homogeneous. So let's start with the first term, d squared x dt squared. Once we have the dimensions of that one, it's going to determine the rest of our terms, again, because they all have to have the same dimensions. So our x is a unit of length dx dt is the change in length with respect to time. But with the second derivative of x with respect to time, we're not changing the length itself. What we're doing is looking at it with respect to time twice. So therefore, our dimensions here are going to be l divided by t squared, where l is length and t is time, or we can write this as lt to the minus 2. So now we know that all of these terms have to have the same dimensions, lt to the minus 2. So let's write them out. So here we have lt to the minus 2 plus a, now our dx dt is the length divided by time, or lt to the minus 1, plus b, and our x has dimensions of length, which equals 0. So in order for this to be dimensionally homogeneous, so therefore, the dimensions of our a are going to be t to the minus 1, or 1 over time, and our dimensions of b are going to be t to the minus 2, or 1 over t squared. And that way, all the terms have the same dimensions of l length times time to the minus 2. 